Mark everyone, she got a whole bunch here reporting for the race. So, last time, well, last time I did a video about Assetto Corsa is actually in the Xbox controller review, which I have right here. And well, yeah, you can kind of control the mouse cursor as well on this, but uh, that's pretty much about it. Well, last time, I actually record with this car here, the Mercedes-Benz 190E EVO 2 on brand Hatch GP, but as you can see on this results, on 10th of April 2018, I actually actually play on the Norch Life just a bit because it's kind of a preparation for trying to do what I'm going to do in this video so yeah there we have it so on that I actually try to play with this for today this is the Pagani Zonda R Let's have a quick look here. Uh, yeah. Let's just talk about the the tech specs here. It weighs 1,070 kilograms and has a power of 750 brake horsepower. Torque is, well, I'm not sure how to say it, but I believe that's a newton meter maybe. Eh, good. I'll have a look on that maybe later. Uh, seven hundred and ten newton meter maybe. Uh, top speed three hundred and fifty plus kilometer per hour. Acceleration from zero to one hundred is two point seven seconds. And yeah, this is quite a powerful car, honestly. <laughs> but yeah. This is one of the fastest car road car that legal for the road, I guess. Yeah, I have to admit I don't know much about cars, all right. So please don't, don't be harsh on me. <laughs> but one thing for sure, I know this car is fast. And uh, let's see how's the color. There's the default, the world record, and the Kunos Racing. This is too bright, let's just go back to default. <laughs> uh, anyway. So, today's challenge is... I have to use a Zoda R on today's track of choice, which is the Notch Live on Germany. It has a length of 20,832 meters. I'm not sure what width is and the pit boxes means, well, just the amount of pit box that are available in the track. Right, let's choose that and well, let's see, uh, let's start with this session here. Time of day, yeah, just that. Weather clear, wind random, wind direction also random. Ambient temperature, I'll just keep it as is. Time multiplier, I'll just keep it as is. But the track surface, I'm gonna change it to old. Because, well, I'm trying to destroy myself here, aren't I? <laughs> Regardless, I don't mind. And here's my realism settings here. Gearbox is manual, but an uh, idle racing light is off, so that's gonna make a problem here and there. I'm not sure what the tire blankets is. Traction control is off, stability control is also off, mechanical damage, I'll just skip it off for now. ABS is also off, fuel consumption, yeah, let's just keep that off, and tire wear it will be keep as is. Well, I, I don't have the proper setup to play racing games on simulator game, but, well, 
this will help a lot since I'm well just I will just I'm just a casual player actually so yeah there's that uh, what else okay that's just the practice well this is just quite a disaster honestly but yeah so right I'm gonna see you on the track right on the strike around there somewhere uh, yeah we'll start from behind the line even though it's practice because well in practice you actually start from the pit but well I have to start it somewhere so I can measure the time strike and well I'll see you on the track Alright everyone, we are on track now. So yeah, our main objective today is try to survive the track while I'm trying to do it as fast as I can. Well yes, as you can see on the lap time there, I'm doing it pretty slow so just I can start it up because well, this car is pretty fast and well, I just don't want to crash it just because I need to... Well, I just don't want to crash it even before I'm recording, alright? So, yeah. Uh, and while I'm doing that, I also just taking a look on the track for one more time. At least, well, some of the, some of the part of the track. So, yeah. Looks like here we are. We're starting. Alright, steering is ready. So in three, two, one. Yeah, pretty slow start. Because uh, the track is not even optimized for this. And I'm using hard tires. And the track is on bad condition. So I don't think we can get into the maximum speed. Oh no. Okay, this car is really fast for me. But yeah. Alright, let's just let go, let go, let go. Alright, slow down, slow down, slow down. Oh no, 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 no. And there we go, we crash it even before. We actually reached the start point. <laughs> oh god damn it. Alright. Uh. I'll just keep it on 3 because I don't want to spin out too much if I can. So yeah, I already crashed it even before we reached the starting line. Oh no, lock up, lock up, lock up, no. Uh, this track is quite the tricky one, honestly. But yeah. I'll try to control my car as best as I can. Oh no, 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 no. Too wide, too wide, too wide. Curve, curve is really evil. Oh uh, yeah, now we are on a nice strike track. Yeah, not much grip, but well, I actually watched Trail Race playing on this track on snow in another game. It's stupid, <laughs> but at least it gives me the idea on how bad if. There are no grip on this part of the track. So yeah, I should be careful. I'm not even trying to reach to... Oh no, oh no. No, wait, 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 wait. No, no, ah. Oh bloody hell. Uh, that's pretty much an objective failed now. I mean, I crashed the car. But... Let's just see how fast I can go there. Oh 
So yeah, I still need more practice on faster car like this. Okay, that's too deep. Alright, let's slow down here because this particular part is really tight. So yeah. Oh god. Man, I'm supposed to use a slower car first, aren't I? But, and yet I chose this because why not, right? Entertainment failure. <laughs> Alright, slow it down a bit there. Okay, a bit lock up on the rear there. Well, not rear, but the front, actually. Okay, curb is really bad. Okay, that's the second crash. Uh, yeah, let's try to go on. Well, maybe I should throw on the damage. Maybe. Alright, this is quite tight and I don't like tight turn like that to be honest. I, I, yeah, still not used to this controller. Maybe it will be better if I have wheels actually, but I don't have the money for that. I wish I have some. Okay, lock up. Alright, some strike here. But I should still be careful, maybe. Yeah, let's try to be careful. No, no, no. Yeah, not too smooth, but good enough, I guess. But still, though, I need to practice some more before actually doing this. Uh, yeah. Well, at least it is much better than using a keyboard to play on this track that it was... I did try to play with keyboard once and... Well, it's not ending well at all. I, I could go faster there, but I don't want to risk it. Okay, this is the carousel part right here, and I'm doing so much later on the shifting. Oh god, oh, oh no no no, no don't, don't speed, don't speed, don't speed! Ah, bloody hell! Yeah, that took so much time there. Yeah, I'm not a professional, but that was even more stupid than I expect. Well, maybe I should try to use uh, a slower car later. Ah, who knows. But, yeah. I'm already a lot more slower than the Porsche GT2 RS here. And yes, the curve is really tall here. Honestly, but... <laughs> yeah, an exciting run because I don't actually have to pay for the actual car here. Especially the damage. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> If this was my real car, I don't want to use it like this, honestly. <laughs> I mean... Well, at least the hypercar, I don't want to let myself doing this. And crash it because I'm doing it. 
So yeah. Oh, what's up with the? Oh no. Okay. Actually, I can turn a lot more aggressive there. Ah. Huh. Okay. That's good enough. After a half lap. Okay. This is so much elevation and stuff right here, which kind of make it harder to. Okay, still go faster. Okay, maybe I break through earlier. Yeah, I think I did. Okay, the second carousel and then the back straight, right? Right, let's do it properly this time. Okay, maybe a bit more turning. All right, under the straight, full throttle. I try to keep it as straight as possible because this car shakes too much. And yeah, not gonna be at the fastest, but still. This is already far too fast for me, honestly. Oh god, oh god, oh god, no, no. Oh, crash. That's the third one, I think. Probably more. Well, this is still got a bit faster. Here and. Onto the line, and we're on 9 minutes and 8 seconds because so much stupid mistakes. Okay, what's the lesson for today? Well, if you, if you have a supercar and you want to let me drive, please don't. I don't want to die. <laughs> and second is, I may need more practice and well, third one, I should buy a steering wheel because it will help a lot with the control and stuff. So yeah, that's the important lesson. Uh, uh, it's quite stressful, right? I mean, well, I never really used to high speed driving in the first place. I mean, well, I am. Just done with the driving lessons a few weeks ago, so I don't have much experience, but yeah. Uh, yeah. There we go. Oh. Hope you guys enjoy me try breaking this car a bit. Well, maybe not a bit. It, it's actually a lot. But yeah, if you want to see more from this, so yeah, please comment on the section down below. So yeah, as usual, if you like my video, hit the like button. If you don't like the dislike button, and if you want to see more of my content, then please hit the subscribe button right down below. And well, if you want to see more of this. Racing games? Maybe you can comment and give me some ideas on what to do here. Because there's a lot of stuff that I can do because, well, can anyone do this game with controller and still not buy all of the DLC because, well, it's kind of expensive for me. <laughs> well, you don't have to mind about that, but yeah. And yeah, I guess that's it for today then. Thanks for watching and remember, I'm keeping my eyes on you. Later.